Thank you all for your time. I appreciate it. Is there, is there anyone else here that's got any particular item or Yes, sir. Yeah, <clears throat> item number 31. I've got a plane to catch for this afternoon. Okay. Going 31 or uh, <coughs> uh, the board of use permit? Yes, sir. Uh, Tim? Can you move that one up? Taking the heat, got a live fish, and I can appreciate it. It's just, it'll take two hours. Yeah. No, Delta, is it, sir? No, it's not. He might be here for a little while longer. You might be in a hurry. Chairman, members of the board, good morning. Uh, resource management has two items for your consideration this morning. The first, the annual regulatory plan was passed on consent. The other is item number 31 found on page RM11. Staff recommends the governing board approve water use permit number 2-121-221-702 sequence 3 with 17 standard conditions and 12 special limiting conditions to Lee Peanut Farms LLC in Suwannee County. This is a modification and a combination of two existing agricultural water uses located in northwestern Swanee County. The two existing permits were the smaller one and then the larger one. To update crop rotations and add an industrial use for car a carrot washing facility. The combined project consists of 996 controlled and 795 irrigated acres with a carrot washing facility located on approximately 80 acres and that would be this 80 acres down here. The industrial use will be implemented in two phases with correspondingly increasing water use. Approximately 90% of the carrot wash water will be applied to forage crops, eliminating the agricultural groundwater allocation for a 185 acre pivot for the four months that the wastewater is available. The supplemental irrigation requirements were determined <coughs> using GRAPs and WUPAR models and the, stat, the industrial use was determined based on efficient use by similar facilities. The facility will be staffed with 120 seasonal workers in phase one and 240 in phase two. These changes from the previous use resulted in a 0 0.3993 million gallon a day increase in allocation in phase one and then another 0 0.1632 million gallon a day increase in phase two from 1.4911 million gallons a day to 2.0536 million gallons a day in one and 10 year drought snare conditions. Phase two of this project will include the preparation and packaging of baby carrots and is anticipated approximately seven years from the permit issuance. All wells and the surface water pump will be monitored using electrical consumption. A lower quality water source is used to offset groundwater use and there are no reports of interference or observed harm to water resources associated with previous withdrawals at this project. The project area is not located within a water resource caution area. Staff has determined the proposed withdrawals will not contribute to a violation of MFLs adopted in 6242 and 40B8 Florida Administrative Code. The application is complete and satisfies the conditions for issuance in Chapter 40B2 Florida Administrative Code. Chairman, I make a motion. I'll second it. Motion is second. Any discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Opposed, same sign. Motion carries. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. That concludes resource management's agenda. Uh, lunch ready? I believe so, but I'll check. Just a it is. I'll tell you what, we're going to, it's only five minutes anyway. We're going to take a break here. Uh, we're going, to eat. we're going to just, you guys want to be back 45 minutes uh, at, uh, I'll say 45 minutes, at 1245 we'll reconvene uh, and we'll just stay in here, at, we'll finish our meeting and stay in here for the workshop. Okay?